Yes, I take this opportunity to welcome each and everyone. Uh, please, if you are new here, tap that subscribe button and the notification bell. So that every time we upload our content, you are the first person to watch. Uh, because I know that you are going to gain much from our content and our videos. Many people <coughs> uh, really uh, don't, don't know how the the business of goat farming is doing and they end up uh, when they are not having the plan of why they are starting up their farms uh if at all you want to start a goat farm you have to first go on the paper and uh, know what you want to do and uh, what you you expect from that project like any other business anyone would wish to join or start even uh, god farming uh, there is a part when we are planning there is a part of structures and you people uh, you may neglect such part and you say ah that one even if if i do uh, si such work in a way that uh, it's not standard uh, and i buy expensive goats uh, because at the end of, of of it all they are the goats that are going to give me money uh that that reasoning uh, at uh, at some extent is not good because even if you bring uh, those expensive goats remember that you have to maintain them to see that you get the offsprings to see that uh, you monitor how they are doing and in that uh, you have to put the uh, the ways of how they can manage those goats in an easy way <clears throat> now even if you go where they will tell you that a raised structure is better than a non-raised one. Uh, for the people that uh, finances are not good, then that option of non-raised structure would be okay. But if at all you know that uh, actually I, I, I have some finance, then I can finance this project, then I recommend you to do a raised structure. Raised structures... Our raised structures, because many people do, out there do the the so-called structures, uh, but our structures can last between ten years to fifteen years, because of the uh, of the the conditions, because uh, because of the the technicals and uh, uh, the the factors that we consider when we are putting up these structures to see that it is really strong for any 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 external force for any internal force for any weight that our animals would be having uh, all of that is considered when we are putting up such structures yeah with that i think uh now you can see the picture I'm going to share with you uh, the final product when we are done. Uh, but this was uh, our third day. And uh, you can see the poles that they are very, very strong for our structure. Because uh, you don't have also to put the bigger, bigger one. You have to put the considerate st uh, size for those, for, for that structure. Thank you for watching. Thank you for following us. Uh, Kim D Construction and Farm Consultants Limited with Kim D Farms Uganda.